Hi everybody, this is the store dude, and today, well, it's starting to get late out after filming Petco, Beep, and Bashes. We are now at a abandoned Sam's Club. After walking home, I realized that um, I almost missed this abandoned Sam's Club. Once again, I still hate the store because it's owned by Bleep. But, um, but I don't hate it as much as I can't say the name from it. I could get caught. <laughs> wow. It's like someone's trying to get in. Oh, God. Oh, oh. <laughs> Almost spoke too soon. Because you could kind of see inside. Not as much as the one I didn't. Oh, you know, I hope you guys did not get my ear. Oh, I think you guys did get my ear. Oh, it's actually still, you can still see the cards in here. Yeah, it definitely seems like someone's trying to get inside. Ugh. That is bleeped shut. Now, last time I tried to do this, the gas station over right over the air was still intact. But it seems like it has been long overdue since it is completely torn down. Now right here obviously was where the tire center was, or auto center, and um, hey buddy, I got my eye on you. By the way, that was a bleep sign. Probably makes sense that there's a Sam's Club near it. Oh, look, tire installation. I don't know how. Okay. Oh, you can kind of see. You know, not very well. Whoa, okay. The thing I was watching was I would have gotten ran over. Okay, so let's, oh. <laughs> um, open. Swift try, and I failed. What's that did? Uh, still can't always see. Oh. I actually, I actually pushed the window back a little bit, so if, if you're a baby, you may have been able to get in. Okay, let's run all the way back and get a workout today on the store, dude. We are going to get a workout, going to the front entrance, and to see bleep. Yeah. All your junky stores have stuff. Hey, Fry's do, Walgreens do, CVS do, Safeways does, Albertsons do. Why do you need a Bleep and Sam's Club to cover you? Why? Just change your medications to a good store. Oh. Ah. Uh. See that someone was also trying to get in again. Ah, oh. actually, wait a second. I may actually try this. I actually may write my my YouTube number on here and stick it right here, so someone can get a little message, not for carbon and the stuff. Or maybe I can just leave it right in the door. And someone will see it. Oh, okay, wait for this dude. That's actually the second time I saw that person. But I forgot something. They did not take down these signs, and they didn't take down the exit sign, but that's not the main thing over here. Look at that, look at that label scar. Look at that. That's even more impressive than the one in and one in Tucson. Oh, and oh, damn, I don't know if I can see. 
It was probably too late, but you can still see the diamond right there. And the other logo on the left that is this tiny, small store, which I do not recognize. Oh, this is what all the carts are. Huh. Huh. Kind of the same size as a Costco cart. You know, I don't really go to Costco. I've seen Costco carts. And we actually have a friend that has a Costco membership. So we sometimes get the get the opportunity to go to Sam's Club at, at least like three months. Every three months, but still not really, don't really get the opportunity that much. I love Costco. It's an amazing big store. Oh, wow. Oh. Oh. Uh. Oh, I heard something. Motion my mom. Okay. Okay, yes, I got my mom to go further away. Yeah. Oh my gosh, six minutes? I didn't think I spent six minutes. But here's a, another kind of impressive Sam's Club label scar. A kind of impressive one. And, oh, well, what's this coat right here? Oh, I didn't know what it is. I know what it is. <laughs> Look at this coat. It's a evil coat. Ha! Anyway, this is going to end our video of the abandoned Sam's Club that is from an evil company. <laughs> Either way, comment, like, and subscribe, and I will see you guys later. But I will not be at that evil buddy. Bye! About seven minutes.